So hello everyone. Today we have a software engineer internship from Atlant and there are two roles in it. Platform engineering internship and front end engineering internship. So if you scroll down you can look at the application process here. So the application is open from 21st of February and the application closes on 7th of March. Then uh, they are telling that there will be an application review where the team will assess your application to determine if you are a good fit. After completion of your application review, you will have an online test. If you, if you get shortlisted in your application review, you will have an online test. And then if you clear your online test, you will have a take home challenge. Based on your uh, test performance, uh, you will have that uh, take home challenge where it will be helpful for them to evaluate your problem solving ability and creativity. Then clearing the take home challenge, you will engage in an interview. And in the interview, they will explore if you are uh, fit for their culture, value and the role. And you will be informed in real time when the interview is scheduled. And then after, uh, and after clearing your interview, you will receive your offer letter. And then this internship will start on 2nd of June 2025. So if you scroll down and look at the program highlights here, you will be onboarded in person on 2nd of June to 6th of June. And the location will be Delhi or Bangalore and it will be confirmed closer to the date. Then uh, the expenses will be covered for the onboarding week from the 2nd of 6th June, right? The Atlan will cover your stay and travel expenses. Then this internship will happen for six months and this is a paid internship and it is a full-time internship. So the work mode will be uh, fully remote after the onboarding. You can work from anywhere. And then uh, about the future opportunities, if you perform well, you can get a full time in Atlant. So this is a very good opportunity where you will be getting salary, you will be working from home, you will be getting a reimburse for the travel and stay for the first week of onboarding. So this is exciting, right? So if you scroll down, you can look at the eligibility criteria here. So students who is currently pursuing a bachelor degree in engineering in India who can commit to a full-time internship can apply for this and also you should have a major uh, in computer science or a closely related field and also you must commit a one week in-person onboarding and a six months fully remote full-time internship then you should demonstrate your dedication for the internship and also you should show your passion to drive to the succeed in the tech industry and these things will be assessed via the application questions and program interviews and you will apply using this link you can just click on this and you can just proceed with this with filling your full name email phone number linkedin url you can include uh, github if you have any and then they are asking uh, which role you have applied for if it is front end or platform intern i said two roles right so you can choose any of that and then uh, you can choose if you have done any internship before and also they are asking for what exactly you to about this opportunity and where do you see yourself contributing to the team and they are asking about the github account and also about uh, if you have made any open source contribution and other things like what are the technology you are proficient in and uh, there are few questions here about will you be able to join on uh, 2nd of june and for six months and also they are telling if you if you are able to onboard in delhi or bangalore you, you will you be able to join them like those things and also you you need to answer yes here because uh, you'll have to select yes because that's the basic criteria here if you are choosing no they will just cut short you you, you will not get selected just need to select yes here on uh, this question and this question and also they are asking if you are interested in continuing for full time after the internship you just need to click on yes and also they are asking which academic year you are in the first year second year third year fourth year fifth year you are graduated and none of the both they are asking for someone currently pursuing a degree right so you need to choose something from here i don't think the graduated person can uh, apply for this role and they are asking for your current location you will just enter that and click on submit up so please read everything uh, correctly and uh, register yourself because this is a very good opportunity so then that's the end of this video if you have any doubts you can ask us in the comment section and also 
If you found this video helpful, you need to subscribe, like, and comment. And then I will meet you in the next video. Until then, take care and bye.